back with another video and today we are doing this um orc burst burst cur grant great sword from um bone reaper and we're doing another orc and then we also have this orc and then we're gonna do maybe this one tonight. It was pretty cool. Okay, let's get to it. And also, real quick, I'll put the paints that I use in the description down below. Uh... This is what he looks like so far. You'll see him better later. <laughs> okay, now we are going back to. I have finished painting the base colors. I finished painting the base colors of the guy. And um, if this thing will focus, it will work. Don't worry. Um, so anyway, this is what he looks like right now. Got his eyes his eyes in and here's his bronze sword but i had to use copper because the bronze wouldn't work okay so now all i'm gonna do is put in the grass um uh, put a few of a little dusting and finally mud okay let's get to it i just took a shower and my nose is running like crazy now let's get to um, i had to delete some footage because for some reason the brightness was on it but now we just use this excess um, pigment to um, wipe at the, to put on the rest of his body. So like his boots and stuff. And then kind of thin out his face a little bit. Get his armor. You want to get the armor a lot. I just realized I forgot put some rust on him that's fine he don't really need rust and now we are going to put on actually yeah I'm gonna quickly like kind of just quickly pack has bass and back and forth with the metallic brown oh yeah it was the metallic wait no was it metallic brown or was yeah I'm just gonna use metallic brown Ugh, there we go Okay, now you get your brush to be super duper thin. What kind of brush is this? Well, let's just use this one. But, okay, now you just grab the tiniest bit, thin it out, and then just start going at it. Go at the armor. You want to make it since it's an orc. This is why, since it's an orc, I'll do this because orcs usually have rusty armor. I 
I think. That's why I, all I know from Lord of the Rings. And Hobbit. Get it on the sword. And now you have his armor on. See? Okay, so now you're gonna have to put another coat of pigment, pigment on there. Look, grab this brush, go like this, and go like, put it back. Mm, voila. Now he looks cool. Okay, now um, uh, you'll do some more stuff to the base since the glue's all dry. And also, since he's in like a muddy area, you, I'm gonna use some wet mud. I don't know what this is. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna just grab a little. It's gonna be on his back like he just fallen. And have it all over. What mud? What mud? Get your. What mud here? on the armor not too much put it on his body a little bit put it on his shoulders and then also put a ton on the boots you want to put a lot on the boots and his armor and now and then you'll be done with this I think you need thinner to get that out of your brush so quickly grab the thinner 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 oh it's just a thinner there we go just. and voila and that is done listening off I hate this small thinner it's gonna be bad headaches okay and your orc will be almost done by now. You just need to put a few small minor touches. If you want, I would put some. Where is it? Part green. Part, part, part green. I would put some part green on his muscles to kind of give him more variety of green. Kind of blend. Okay, one sec. I gotta give him a variety of green. Just kind of mix it in. And with the dark green, it'll make it look very nice. Like, as you can see, he already looks really cool. And, yeah, the part green is now all shaken up. Just want to grab a little bit, not a lot. Just kind of put it on some of his muscles, really. Kind of make it look... Like he's a kung fu fighter. Don't sing that or else you will be copy. Just kind of put it around on his body. Just put it around like there. Right there. And you should be good. If you really want to put more, you can. But I wouldn't suggest putting more. Because then it kind of ruins the look to it. And then next, you want to grab your pigment again. Kind of, just kind of shake it up. And then you want to grab this brush. Like that. And then just go at it a little bit inside of there. 
and just kind of use the rest on his body. And you are done. And that is how you make a Orc Bursker Great Sword. And see you later. Bye bye.